I don't know. Let's see. What does the real universe look like outside the simulated one? Any thoughts? That's a good question. I'm not thinking it looks a lot different than the one we're in now. And I, I believe that the entire skyscape that you see right now is a multi-tiered hologram full of nodal apertures and variable stars that produce phenomena optically, but they're not real stars. However, the simulacrum, simulacrum is a real word in the Oxford, Oxford English Dictionary. It just means a copy of something else, and this is what I call reality. Simil it is similar. It is a copy of a real universe. So, I believe that the Creator has never stopped creating. There was no creation event, ever. God is eternal. And with so many, with, with, with creation ongoing, it's going to require a whole race of envoys, emissaries. Bible call, the Bible calls us kings and priests in the future go through all these other civilizations and, and they don't have to go through what we went through. But then again, they haven't been given the eternal inheritances that we, we're we going to get. There's a reason for all this. It's playing out for our edification. It's playing out to build our eternal personalities. It's also contained. So every evil that is experienced among the sons of men you like my little Bible speech? Every evil experienced by the sons of men, every evil created by people, it's contained. It's not going, there's no cross-contamination with the outside real universe. It's all right here. And when all and when he comes to set the captives free, there will be an exodus. The exodus is all the immortal souls who've been living all these sim cycles will be removed from the construct, leaving nothing but the construct. When the construct goes straight into the lake of fire, annihilation. It's not needed anymore. That negative default programming universe, the simulacrum, and everything inside of it that refused to change or, or real, it's going to get burned up and destroyed. So it does not c contaminate the real.